So problem solving is not exactly a standalone subject. I think there are three uh, strategies that the school has adopted to teach uh, problem solving to our students. And uh, in the process of problem solving, I think the use of life skills and soft skills are very important. So for uh, the teaching of academic subjects, the teachers plan and deliver their lessons using assessment for learning uh, principles. So these uh, principles will help students to be critical thinker, independent thinker as well as reflective thinker. I think problem solving right um, allows them to think critically. Okay, they are given a problem, so before they can solve the problem, they need to identify like what are the um, considerations, analyze the problems from different angles. So this will allow them to think okay, before they go about doing something. As, at the same time, it also promotes collaborative learning, communication, which are all 21st CC skills, which they should have for them to be able to adapt to the ever-changing world. Problem solving, uh, it definitely uh, equips me with more knowledge and skills on how to uh, get, how to understand and interpret saving plans. So, uh, like sometimes when I see bank brochures where they show me all the saving, uh, saving rates and all, I kind of uh, like don't really understand what's going on. But after this lesson, I understand. Like it seems more familiar to me, and then it also prepares me for the future. Then for as for communication. You have to communicate with each other. In term so one, the first ten weeks, the teachers conduct the, the lesson. So the activities are in term uh, in the form of games or simple uh, activities, uh, outdoor activities, and we infuse school values and uh, social emotional learning competencies into these uh, games so that we can help our, our students uh, bond faster, be more confident, and able to relate to each other better. After the first term of uh, games are over, then we get uh, the students to plan and uh, innovate innovate and plan their own uh, activities and programs. This activity will require them to work together as a team and uh, to design on the game, to change the rules to make sure that it's more interesting and not just a normal standard game. Uh, to infuse some uh, school values and competencies inside each game which are related, uh, which are related to the game.